Oh yeah, here we go. actually the mount from the last video at the end so I've actually started this morning just to get that glaze on that crucible um, so it's not my regular not a regular type of session I'd rather just video from start to finish as I'm doing it but um, doing the crucible video which is the last one um, you got to do it in stages and it takes time to dry it and all type of thing but yeah So I filled up that crucible, as you saw in the last video, I'll put that up. Um, I've got a few there heating up already. So once that sort of melts down, by the time I finish my cuppa, should have been, um, we might be able to add a bit more to it shortly. It's a nice cool morning this morning, I've got a look at the flame and it's just a really nice, really nice flow, it spins around if you see it. See it spinning around. Let's have a quick look and see if we need to add more. Yeah, it's nearly there. You can sort of see. We're going to add a little bit more to it. This will be shortly. Show you this. This is. I'll show you me young blokes. Me young blokes finished the pond, and it looks bloody amazing. While we're waiting for that cop to mount, he's finished it. He's done a bloody marvelous job. Look at that. It just makes you. They're real plants too. They're 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 fake plants there, there, and there. They're real. Um, cabbage ones that's real that's real everything else is real I don't know if you can see any fish yet there's 10 goldfish in there if you look down there there's one right down there if you can see uh, it's looking bloody good and then it goes like that so we drilled a hole on some rocks Looks bloody good, doesn't it? I really like it. I find it relaxing to have a beer out here. And then you um you can just watch it. Really enjoy that. I really like watching that um but anyway, this will be melted shortly. Oh look at that, I'm gonna add some more. I'll get this full and then we'll have a pour. It's a really good idea to heat up the tongs as well because don't forget that's going to be grabbing the crucible. It's going to be over 1100 degrees. 
you don't want cold tongs on a hot crucible. I don't normally show this bit. But this video is not a normal video. this so I'm not back to you. So these are my new crucibles. Oh there's a bit of weight in that. Oh there's some weight in that. Look at that beautiful. I don't even think I need to skim anything off that. That's pretty, pretty clean. All right, here we go. I'm gonna try a different angle. I, I notice you guys like like it when I pour it dead on. So that's what we're doing today. First time I've used this crucible. Just where I'm out. Well, I'm gonna go stick that back in the um, furnace. You can see them cooling down. They're still cooling down there. We'll let them cool down. There we go, look at that. I'll we'll just let that cool down naturally now. Turn the gas off. Look at these little beauties. They're steaming hot and they're nice and clean. The end one wasn't the perfect one, but uh, there you go. Got four perfect ones. That is really hot, so I'm going to stand back. I had to make a new um, I had to make a new crucible tongs as well. So that's what I did there. All right, we'll go get a bucket of water and we'll quench them. do this one because that was first shit it's amazing how the copper ones fall out compared to the aluminium I had trouble with the aluminium ones
there's a little one here. Probably keep that one like that. Nice cute little one. Alright, we'll go set this up here. In the bucket. When we get you real close so you can actually see properly. Here we go. So you watch this, it cools from the bottom to the top, you watch. Amazing, they're really clean bars in, they are really clean. That's a nice size bar, that one. Really like that one. I might have to clean that up there. Right, while that's doing that, I'll just show you. This is um, the re remaining copper that I've got in my... That's the remaining copper I've got in my bucket. So I've got a high heat more of copper. Um, I've still got three welders to scrap. Well, that's doing that. All right, we got. I still got three welders to scrap in. So we got those three. So we got those three to scrap. So we might do them soon. Might just do the cables first, and then do the machines themselves in another video. We'll see. But anyway. Alright guys, I've already cleaned these ones up, so put them over there, they look really nice with that. Alright, so I'm going to use this piece, be careful when you use these, they are friggin' dangerous. So um, that's all I've got at the moment, I've got to get some new ones for the drill. So anyway, here we go. All right, here we go. So, 976. Mm, nearly two kilo, 1962. 2.940. Oh, four and a half kilo, there you go. So you got four, five, five, three grams. So and what have we gotten? That is 160 ounces. Ten pounds. Ten pounds, there you go. 
Didn't realize it was 10 pounds. 4.55 kilo, 10 pounds, 160 ounces. There you go, guys. Hope you like that. They look really nice, MD. Right, so that's 43, 44, 45, 45, 46, 47, and that little one, 48, 48 of those, oh, 49, sorry, there's, just, there's that shiny one I did, how nice is that? So that's 49, oh shit, there we go, 49, there you go. Alright guys, if you like that, subscribe, like and all the rest of it. Cheers guys, thank you for supporting the channel. Look at that. Whew. Thank you for supporting the channel guys. Um, later on I'm going to polish, um, I actually polished that one the other day, just gave it a little rub up. But we're actually going to do this, this big one. We'll sand and polish that one another day. So that's 3.1 kilo. And I've cleaned that one up as well. I've actually got that one nice and flat now. So we'll do the same thing with that one. All right. All right. Cheers, guys. See you next time.